Hey John, it's Thursday. Ooh, weird. So we, um, for those of you that are watching this video, John and I have decided to move our days back. Um, well, we decided to move John's back to Sunday just because it'll be easier for him since he has a regular Monday to Friday job. Um, and I'm going to move mine back to Thursday, so there's still the same amount of time between each one. Um, just because going into working at Disneyland, provided I get the job, fingers crossed, um, I will probably be working most Friday, Saturday, and Sundays. Um, at least more often than weekdays, so Thursday would probably be a better day for me. Um, so yeah, that's, that's what's up with that. So here in sunny Southern California, we are preparing for the storm of the century. If you can't tell by the blue sky. So Gabe and I are out to get some sun before the quote Pineapple Express or Rain Mageddon or whatever the heck Storm Mageddon that people are calling it. Whatever. I doubt it's going to hit us down here. It's supposed to hit Northern California. But just in case, we're out getting some sun. So since we're out and about today, we are going to be doing the couples one, two, three tag, which is basically just a tag that went around YouTube probably like six months ago. But I always wanted to do it. And now that I'm finally doing YouTube again, I figured I would do it. We're on a hike and I'm out of breath. But we'll go ahead and uh, maybe do it once we get to the top of the mountain. Who knows? See you in a second. The rules of this tag is that there are 10 questions and for each question we're going to be answering them for each other. So for instance, for the first question we'll say, okay, what does Lauren think about this? Or what is Lauren's favorite this? And we'll both answer for me and then we'll both answer for Gabe. So it'll be kind of fun to see like what my actual answer is and what Gabe thought my answer would be and vice versa. So, all right, here we go. Okay, question one. If your BF or GF or spouse could be married to a movie star, who would it be? So I guess we'll do me first. Okay. So we'll say one, two, three, and then we'll say the answer. So if I could be married to a movie star, this should be pretty easy. All right, one, two, three. Misha, Misha Collins. Collins, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, for Gabe, oh geez, I have no idea. Um, uh, Should we do one, two, three? Yeah, one, one two, two, three, three Anna, Anna Kendrick. Kendrick. Yep. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> two, if your spouse could be a celebrity, who would they be? For me, one, two, Wait, if you could, if I could be a celebrity, like if I could encompass their life and okay. personality and whatever. Okay, one, two, three, Jennifer Misha Lucky. Collins. Oh, I thought then you could hang out with Misha Collins. That's true. That's Jen's true. Michaels. It's a, it's a, it's a good, it's a good. Um, Plus, you'd be tall and beautiful. <laughs> have luscious hair. I mean, I already have the hair, right? All right. Oh, this is plain. actually longer. No, I actually think it is. So, if Gabe could be a celebrity, who would it be? I don't know, and it sounds like he doesn't either. Okay. Um, he could be a celebrity. I have, I honestly have no idea. It's a matter of countdown. Um. Don't want, you won't get it anyways. Okay. One, two, three, Ellen Stephen DeGeneres. Colbert. <laughs> <laughs> well, just kind of, uh, I mean, because she has a sweet show. And oh, she's yeah, funny man. funny, and everyone likes her. Okay. If you've gone to the 7-Eleven to get milk and decide to buy your, like, other person... A treat, what would you buy? So if I were to go and buy something for you, what would I get you? Okay, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> I didn't think of an answer. <laughs> what would you buy? It, it would have been a chocolate bar. It would have been a chocolate bar. <laughs> I didn't think of an answer. Okay. I know what I would get and you now for me, and I know too. Okay. One, two, three. Dr. Pepper. Pepper. Oh. oh. <laughs> Okay. Well, you, but you love barbecue. Yes, right? I do. That, I that do. That is what I usually get. Okay. Dr. Number four. What percentage of the housework would you say that I do? So what would I say that I do, and what would you say that I do? Okay. Uh, One, two, three. Ten percent. Oh. <laughs> I think Gabe does way more than me. Okay. Um, well, this kind of defeats the purpose for this one, but what would you That's say? That's okay. I'll, I'll play the game this time. Okay. So. Ready? One, two, three. Ninety percent. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you would stick up the ass. No, because I know what your answer is now. But I don't... <laughs> oh, I don't feel like we'll have answers for this. If your spouse could choose one thing for you to get rid of, what would it be? So what would Gabe want me to get rid of, and what do I think Gabe would want me to get rid of? I don't know. We don't have that much stuff. I know. Um, one, two, three, shoes? Shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to think of that ahead of time. Um, I'm going to switch sides with you. And my arm's it's, getting... And now it's your turn. Now it's what I think you would want me to get rid of? Yeah. So what do I think? What do you... I don't know. One, two, three... I have no idea. I don't know. 
<laughs> I don't have that much. We don't have stuff. Okay. We have like, yeah. What is your spouse's most repeated sentence or phrase? For me. So my most repeated sentence or phrase. What is your, okay, let me think about that for a second. Um... Okay, no, no, we just have to do it. Okay. One, two, three. Something if you know what I mean. Oh. <laughs> Something frustrated. I do get frustrated a lot. Okay, what do I think your most repeated sentence is? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know. Do you even know? I don't know. What do I say? I don't know. Uh, one, two, three. I love you. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. What is your spouse's most used cuss word? For me? Swearing ahead. Um, I know what mine is. I don't know if you know what mine is, because I, I swear a lot. Um, ready? I don't know. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> what is your most used cuss word? One, two, three. Shit. Shit. Yeah. Um, what is your spouse's ultimate favorite movie? This is way too easy for me. Um, and this is way harder for Gabe. Okay, so, for me, one, two, three, nice a night's tale. tale. Um, for you, there's like three or four that this could be. I know what I'm going to answer as right now. Okay, one, two, three, Empire master and commander. Back. Okay. <laughs> so, my, um, my camera died. So, I have no idea if this will actually make it into it or not, because I've never filmed on my iPhone before, but we'll try. Um, so, I think the question where it ran out of battery was the fire question. So, we'll just redo that, even though... We already did my answer. Oh, yeah. So if the house was burning down and we've saved everything important, like, you know, loved ones and and ourselves, what would we go back to get? Um, so for me, Mac. one, the two, computer. three, Mac. Oh, yeah, my computer. We already did this, but I don't Mac? know. <laughs> Mac. Okay, so for Gabe, one, two, three, computer. computer? Yeah. yeah. Pretty easy. What else you need? I don't know. <laughs> question 10. So this question is... If they say that opposites attract, what would your spouse say is something that is opposite between the two of you? So, like, something that I do that, like, you don't do at all, or, oh. like, is opposite. So, I know what my answer is. Um, it's very windy. Let's go this way. So, what's something that you, like, what's... Like, something that's, like, opposite about us. Okay. So... So, what would... What so, would like, for say? me. So, like, one, two, three. Calmness? Oh, yeah. stuff and when I like something it becomes all consuming and like stuff like that and Gabe's just like yeah so we are still on our hike um I'll see if I can show you the vista up top see what see what happens with that so all right so if you're looking on this screen there's an Albertsons like right there right there, Albertsons, right there. and then if you were to follow that street all the way beyond this mountain that's where we live so we it takes us about 20 minutes to walk to that Albertsons well that's about all I have to say today um, I've done basically nothing this week, so I have nothing really to report because we gave back our rental car, so we've just been like stranded at our apartment and whatever's within walking distance. Um, yeah, so hopefully next week I will have some very fun things to tell you um, pertaining future employment. Hopefully tears that I experience in next week's vlog are tears of happiness or joy and not tears of sadness or frustration. Yeah, but until then, I will see you on Sunday, and you will see me next Thursday. Bye, John! Oh, P.S. Um, I am going to put the questions in the description below, so if you're watching this on YouTube, you can go ahead and click the, like, show more or whatever, and it'll have all the questions, and you and Anne should do this on, um, Sunday. I was going to say Monday, but Sunday. Um, uh, alright, bye! Look at the weed hole. It's a weed hole. See it? It's crawling. He's all fuzzy.